pleasure but now with a C. But same ametuwekea hapa picha ya manyama zimeanikwa na sioni yenye moja simu uzi si na si ngombe sijui ni nyama zinakaa je by the way but okay Charles uh, says he says malenge uh, braza ut this is food kidogo nayo mm? Nancy Nduwati ameniguza fast jo ameniita morning val good morning babe mimi as long as food ni tamu siondoke walai e acha tumalizie hapo alafu tuanze na panelists karibu sana please do give us a pen no i'm not supposed to be giving you yeah i'll give you a penny for your thoughts and please put your thoughts down on our social media thank you hi guys how are you ni eh eh what's aka ni mam sweet and hi what's your name my name is Vanessa Ngugi a young leader with the Kenya Girls Association and i'm also a Bachelor of Arts in Project Planning and Management student at the University of Nairobi. I'm also a blogger, an environmentalist, and greening the nation is my greatest passion. Nani, nani, uyu, uyu, wangari madhai. Yes. You're mini wangari madhai. Yes. You're very passionate. Yes. Why environment? What do you blog about, the environment still? Yes I do blog about the environment. So unaenda unasema hii miti ni kubwa hii side. Huko hakuna miti mingi. Mimi napenda miti. Hivyo? Exactly. Especially the brown spaces in Kenya. My greatest ambition right now at the moment is to make them all green because mm -hmm. I believe that to stop this global warming issue mm -hmm. and water shortage issue it's only trees that can save us as at now. Where? We we on a very focused. Okay, all right. I was not expecting that. How can we find you on social media? On social media, um, on Facebook, I'm Vanessa Ngugi. Mm -hmm. On Twitter, Ngugi underscore Vanessa. On IG, Ngugi Vanessa. Mm -hmm. All right, baby girl. Hi. How? Oh, na me shanza kusmile from ear to ear. Ata jase makito. Hi. Hi. How are you? Fine. Mama na kuita man. Uh, Lydia Lodge, mm -hmm. mm, student at the University of Nairobi, mm -hmm. mm, taking mass communication and journalism. Mm -hmm. And that is Achini, but quite currently she is also doing things in production. This is a pro super producer in the making. Super! Ni vile tuwa Natiza Achini, wata ni msaidie. Social media tunafata na kitu. Uh, Oluwach Lydia. Ivo tu kila mahali. Ivo tu kila mahali. Alright. Mm. So, leo tuna... Yesterday, let me from the beginning. Yesterday was the seventh of June. Today is the eighth, obviously, and it was World Food Safety Day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now, the point of this whole World Food Safety Day is it draws attention and mobilizes uh, action to prevent, detect, and manage foodborne risks and improve human health. So now, the theme of this year was safer food and better health. But not not to cut it twist to kidogo first of all, okay? Mm -hmm. So we're still talking about food and and our health generally as Kenyans, as young Kenyans, youthful Kenyans, kai youth, nenda kumaliza youth, youth Kenyans. And I want to talk. About, I want to talk about our eating habits. Sisi kama tuanze na watu akampo, because that's a that's a place you are right now. We to kama smocha. Na yu ni kitu, by the way, that has been invented recently. Ni sawa kitu kama smocha. So I I want to know. What people are eating on the ground? Why we're eating it? Ni pesa atuna ama ni kuna tu vitu zinine ata tukwe na pesa ina kaje people still eat it. Eh? Yeah. Are we eating healthy? Do we know what eating healthy is? Do we think eating healthy is expensive? Eh, na kuna food gani? And this I'm just umbrella. We'll start from somewhere, but this is generally how the conversation is going to go. Kuna chakula zingine uneza pata mtu na kula just because unasikianga mtu akona pesa yuko lazy vitu. Na baby, you don't even like it, you know. It's like caviar. You know, caviar is its fish eggs, and it's it's very otas like it's very high class. But maybe ata moto high pendi vingi na taste, but ata kula tu. Mtu tanga ngang kwa pizza just because pizza is the thing to eat. Na bege. Maybe they don't even like it. So these are the kind of things we'll be talking about. So please do tell us what you are feeling, how you are thinking, etc., etc. So to kianzia na watu akampo tu wana kula nini? Asa sema tu wana kula nini? Si kama kwa ida smocha. Aha. Una una jua isn't of it to say at least watu akampo tu neza afford sana sana. Chapodondo, chafua. Ni kujipikia, mna jipikia, ama ni kibandas. Is bae. 
kibandaski unajua tena kujipikia pia is a bit hard why hmm? as in time uh, alafu unelewa tu venye finance yo, uh, yo finance ya ya ya, ya kampo huko hmm. hiyo status hmm. unaelewa hiyo kwa don kidogo so unajua most watu si kila mtu hasa lazima anaweza patio ni moment ya kurefill gas na ni kama stove ka outdated mm-hmm. mm. so kibanda at least kibanda is the easiest juu uko utapata kila kitu umeprepareiwa na mafuta na nyanya na kitungu na everything and it's always ready that's why unapata tunakula stuff kama hizo juu ni easy mm-hmm. eh. help me understand eh, ni, ni, ni nini wa tunapenda kukula tuanze hapo wewe unapenda kukula nini Um basically for me napenda kukula chapo kuku. Mhm. Kai na nimesikia mtu kwa comment hawezi hata ukimfinya aje. Chapo kuku. Mm. Chapo kuku, chapo cabbage beef hapo tu sasa. Wewe unapenda chapo? Eh. Tuseme. Eh hapo tu. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is there a nutritional value for what the things that we like to eat? Like what tuna balance ama tuseme tuna Wana wenda ni amezwa no, no, no. What balance talk to me? What do you think we balance kabla ni fikie? Um basically for me I think it's essential to balance mm-hmm. because if you don't balance then you lose it all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because there's no you'll kula starch 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 starch. Utasikia tu njaa. Talk to me. Talk to na nikukaribu kukuita hiyo jina ulisema tusikuite tena. Sorry. Ni sawa, ni sawa. Ni sawa. Okay, personally I don't think if we usually balance ju unajua uh sai like watu wanafikiria anga if we balance tunaka like washamba. That's why unaona staffs kama pizza and unataka watu unaona watu wanangana kula. Like mtu hizi kunywa like uji na gideri due to them ni analog wow yet hiyo ndio balance they are mm. poor to take tuna mtu atamka anataka maybe uh, like nikwambia anataka maybe arauke akule chipo ama ata lunch akule chipo sapo akule chipo na ututu kukutwa soma mm. instead of kutafuta tu kukienyeji nzuri yenye migrotu vizuri akule like at least he add nutrients kwa mwili yake tunangana kula chemicals just mm-hmm. because we don't want to be seen out dated mm-hmm. eh. okay between healthy food and fast food acha kabla nisifike which one is easier to access which one do you prefer to eat like una twende home nikupikie kenye unapenda kabisa kabisa na nipike vizuri ama twende kfc uh, mimi twende tu home nipikie But kama KFC kuna food poor so, like kama KFC tunaweza pata gali na mrenda mi just fine. <laughs> kuna time alikuwa na savu gali. Do you remember? Do you remember? Definitely. <laughs> What an show guys. If you don't remember there was an incident at some point where KFC came out as a company and said wali walikuwa wamemaliza waru. Eh waru zilikuwa zimeisha hiyo moment. They, they used their own I, th- I think they used to import or something. So they they stopped you know offering fries on the menu. So instead walikuwa na pano gali. We 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 influencers squeeze tonight at influencers with social lights when leader kfz ko nini ko review kwa wote wote wa kweli kwani ugali ilikuwa na video ilikuwa na kwa tamaa no i would not do that again so the government kaambia bro watu mmesema ati ukulange ati wa rozeta tumetoka hapi imagine utatumia tu wa rozeta imagine <laughs> just imagine and boom now we have fries back at the establishment mm. okay so talk to me why is it uh, pia again this is this is ini kitu na pia status quo you know mm. i want you to see me kwa line ya kfc lakini sitaki unione kwa mamboga nikijaribu ku bargain to buy dania na tunyanya na nuhu eh shida iko wapi um basically for me nafikiria shida inakaa kwa wasi hataki ku accept like even the vitu zinakaa kwa grow but kuna hii essence ya peer pressure ile nye watu kuonekana like juu fulani na fulani anafanya hivi na hivi so hata mimi acha njeke hapa but tunajiumiza So the thing is wewe kubali tu pale uko. Ka ya KFC uko nayo kwa mfuko enda ubai. Kama huna enda kwa yema mamboga. Siku ya 5 spinach ya 5. Kitungu ya 5. Umeona hapo kama gali. Hapo kama mka kale ka frog ka green hivi alafu kana kuna kama baa huda. I'm like 
Bro, sisi unipate tu cha pamoja na hiyo sufuria yenu ulikuwa na savia supu si usioshe. Usioshe. Ati KDF ume kidogo alafu unipe. <laughs> but because life is hard oh. si kutaka eh. si kutaka mm. we acha niguzie hii part na, na, na nitaiguzia kwa umbali ndio nisi offend watu si ndio mm. so recently there was a manifesto that was released to mm -hmm. the kenyans mm -hmm. na kuna kaflani mahali that did not sit well with some people there are some people who agree but <laughs> <laughs> point ni point ni that the point of the conversation is the thing i can afford to buy please let me buy it si ndio kama si kama wewe umezaliwa na tupesa all your life so maybe unaona kenya mimi nafanya na kula matumbo wewe unaona hiyo ni chakula ta maskini man wewe unakula hizo vitu like why alafu zite nywele wewe unakula hizo nywele i mean i'll tell you please mimi sijawahi kuwa na venye nimelelewa atakuwa na option bora tushibe nona venye kama mwanaume anakulanga hata ikangi chumbi toxic masculinity bora ushi bora ushibe eh so how do we get away from that? How do we get away from saying cabbage? Cabbage ni ya January peke yake. Tumekula nyama December mzima sasa January is cabbage time. How do we unlearn this? Um basically nadasema again we go back to the issue of finances. And kila mtu anajatoka the same place. Kuna mwenye ametoka tseme mudaiga, kuna mwenye ametoka place kama dare. Na kuna leo mseme mwenye ametoka the middle class. Mm -hmm. So tuseme hakuna vile mtu aitoshana. So ni wacha za between your means. Mhm. Mm Pale mfuko inafika wewe pange na hiyo. Mm -hmm. Na hii notion ya cabbage January then the rest of the months to kule nyamo or something of the sort. Mm -hmm. Um basically na rudi tena kwa ile point yangu. Cheza within your means. Ju kuna ile msamo daiga. Nyama kwake that's just but a penny. Wow. Basa kuna yeye mwingine kwa Islando, hata yeye 50 bob kuipata. Ni hard. So what do you do? Hmm. Kwa una za afford kukula ile gideri ya 20 bobs ji that. Kula. Na kama uweze afford yoke to ngu ya kuikaranga ama nyanya nini. Chukua, kula, chemsha maji, kunywa, hmm. endelea na life. Actually hata bei ya mafuta imepanda. Eh. Hey. Hmm. All right. So, I have a question for you. So, I'm not going to say that I'm going to you. But remember, you first, you're watching Wine in the Morning. And you can find us at Wine on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter, Y254 underscore channel on the ground. Today, we're talking about uh, yesterday's huge event, which was World Food Safety Day. And we're trying to figure out, as Kenyans, as young Kenyans, are we eating healthy? Can we afford to eat healthy? Is eating healthy expensive? Mm hmm Sasa ni kikuuliza babe. For example, naona venye amesema kuna classes za zake. There's high class, there's middle class, there's uh, the lower class. Uh, but a lot of us are living below the poverty line. But that's not the point. The point is, hata huyu mwenye kwa na pesa mingi, akiamua leo, akule nyama, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, yu njine, for two months, si atakuwa mgonjwa. Mm. So how do we fix this? How do we tujitoe kwa hii mentality? Because also, kukula fast food is not a bad thing. Miu kinipata Sanford tusisumbuane. Sao, because I'm very happy wa meirudisha. <laughs> I was suffering when they had closed for some time. <laughs> yeah. So, how do we get out of this mentality? To say me ati oh, sasa juu ni rich kid, atakula tu nyama. Mwenye rich kid, afai kukula nyama kila siku. We mwenyewe pia uneza pa kujitreat pia kitu kitu nini. Hey, so help me understand how to balance. Unona in such a situation, sasa apo atuongei who is rich, who have and who doesn't have. When it comes to eating, like tunafa to learn healthy eating tips. Unelewa, kukula nyama from Monday to Monday, it's not healthy. Na pia, like, to see, to, to nafa to jue, stuffs like uh, uji, githeri. Okay, nyama is good, but you don't have to take it from Monday to Monday. Uh, pizza is good, but pia, you don't have to take it each and every time. As in, it's, to see angalia tinania kona dona niana. To learn to kukula healthy, like to accept. Mwogo mm -hmm. is fine, it's mm -hmm. healthy. Mm -hmm. Gwashe is healthy, Gideri is healthy, Uji is healthy. Mm, like, Gwashe when you slap, man. Mm. As he, it's, <laughs> mm. it's healthy. Like, to square to na. By the way, that's. Wait, we are. We are woo! Kenya tu amesema to na kam to say, Maliza, Maliza. As in, to see, to see, kaya to na angalia. 
your financial status ya mtu ndo inadetermine what you have to eat like to kwe at the back of our mind is whatever we are taking healthy is it good for our health yeah? it's not a matter of how much do i have no na kwenda kfc is not bad but going there monday to monday mm. is wrong mm. unaji affect health wise sometimes just get uh kunde kwa soko and just wash it clean prepare it with the galia mwogo then take it it's healthy you are saving your life like sunona say we, we have a lot of people suffering from obesity especially watu wa maju na it's something that tuna adopt at sisi kuna watu wako overweight right now mm -hmm. not because at at nini it's because our kuli healthy mm -hmm. eh wanataka tu eh pizza because when ogopa ah mimi nikikula nini mm. uh vala like there was a moment nilikuwa hotel ingine hapo and and uh, uh, i was with someone sasa tukauliza at what do you want to take and they said mimi nataka ugali na mrenda na nyama and they were like uko sure ni as it even the waiter was like uko sure that's what you want and i'm like yeah this is what you are. i don't know whether they were expecting me to say mimi nataka pizza ama they were expecting me to say nataka fry na kuku as in siji what were they ex actually aki ungeona venye walikuwa naniangalia i eh waiter was like madam uko sure are you sure this is what you want and the other person was like Lydia so change jokes. Sindio kenyewe natakula. Nikwambia eh this is what I want. Maybe hata nikimaliza mneza ni pia uji then ni kwa okay. Wewe well, no. na like by the way. I like the way that she went to a place where you're supposed to be asking for pasta, carbonara. Na kaitra mrenda na ko tu na umtishima. This is the kind of confidence you should be walking with. I really like it. I really like it. Okay, so sir, kabla ni sahau alikuwa me mention kitu. We're talking about um the kind of healthy foods to me mention cassava, me mention guashe and then she said something something amero. So my next question was sasa sisi kama wa Kenya again still this is very local. So mali tumetoka it affects hata sikuulizi by the way. I scratch that sis wali. Mali umetoka in effect. Juzi and Juzi I don't know if it was last year but it was a while ago there was a particular media station ilifanya kasave fulani walienda western. Na walikuwa tu wanaongelesha wanaume. So akawaliza wanaume mnaweza kula ugali yani sapa bila ay 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 almost not even almost 100% alisema siwezi siwezi kula chakula bila nyama. How? Eh? Mm. Nyama kama si leo tunakula kesho samaki, hatuwezi kula mboga peke yake. Mwanaume aje? Haya, tunajua pia kuna mahali watu wanasema nakula mchele, wanalala njaa. Sitasema ni waluya, sijasema hivyo. <laughs> sijasema hivyo. <laughs> But clearly mali tumetoka pia ina effect, si ndio? Mm. Tunafaa kuinfluenceiana ama ni nini? Because not all of us are, are eating as healthy as we should more some some regions eat i don't know maybe pia story na farming or or the things that we actually reap from the land but should we be cross referencing sisi kama watu kama wewe umetoka western na mimi nimetoka north eastern we talk about it um kama 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 the talk it's about like itakuwa healthy talk mm. fine mm. but sio sio ile ya ku influence just sasa mimi ukula pizza kwetu wewe pia na ku expect to go na kula pizza i'm not helping you na na tukirudi back to the reality i'm not also helping myself mm. naelewa uh, as in let's learn mimi nasema hakuna influ just learn these things are all over just mm -hmm. take your time learn mm -hmm. learn knowledge mm -hmm. is important mm -hmm. just go there atuki and the internet you can just learn this thing Uh, healthy eating tips si uh, usingoje ni ku influence usingoje ni kuambia venye na kuja na kulanga kwetu ndio pia wewe uanze ku adopt na kula kwenye unaelewa mm. but si, si mbaya leo nikikula nyama kesho ni kule samaki kesho kutwa ni kule nguruwe hivyo hivyo it's not bad mm -hmm. si ndio eh, at least iko na nime balance nimeka mboga kuna mm. ka fruits kando mm -hmm. unaelewa mm -hmm. eh, but sasa si ile ati oh nyama 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 mm. nyama nyama mm -hmm. no no sasa tutaambia nini wa Masai ushaenda <coughs> wa Masai wa Masai nenda kukuuza kidogo acha <laughs> nimalize statement because hiyo siku tulienda 
tulienda tulikuwa wapi tulienda Laikipia haikuwa kaja ada ya Laikipia sasa tumeenda kwao it was a, an event kind of thing situation either mtu alikuwa na graduate ama ni kitu kama hiyo sisi tulikuwa tumetoka shoot so tukaenda tukapiti tukapitia my friend hiyo time ya kupika kuna aina kama nne ya nyama kuna matombo kuna mwingine sijui anapika pika nini hiyo side nyingine kuna mwenye anapika hiyo damu ndio eh, na hiyo pia kitu ni tamu nilikuwa mm. naidharau but mm. ni tamu kuna mwingine yani zote ni nyama mboga ni moja <laughs> na ugali ni bigi so are we going to tell someone like that uh, tradition yako is it's not mm -mm. right Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. At ways, but we are many a man. Don't talk to me. <laughs> so, hashtag is WCW in the morning. Uh -huh. um, well, basically, on that aspect, um, since the man in Baya, but I tell you, Rudy, I call you a little comeoliza. Now, as I say, Matu, we say to Rudy back to our culture where it all started from because. I believe is my first food zilikuwa janga na wazungu mm. as Africans were having what you were really Ata bitu eating. Kama askari ilikuwa janga na wazungu. Bitu kama askari ilikuwa janga okay we were having sugar canes right? Mm. Tulikuwa na utamu. Tulikuwa na utamu. Africans are sweet. Mm. I tell you. Mm. Proud to be black. Mm. Mm. <laughs> na haturingi by the way. But vile sa wazungu alikuwa janga na history ya ukoloni then building up stuff manufacturing things processors and everything up on the sasa we chemicalize like almost everything because to make to come if food spaghetti spaghetti litoka italy lasagna litoka hmm. italy uh -huh. so <laughs> <laughs> so to say me, yeah, as in proud. cultures as in i really support this thing of we should borrow notes from each other's cultures like ni culture gani really from our local communities in Akula healthy and at least borrow a leaf so like to me for example kuna this anya na kulanga ile ugali ya wimbi i highly support it than kukula ile ugali ya mahindi yenyewe hmm. because it's more nutritious so if we can only substitute that then we can go a really long way mm -hmm. So this thing of healthy eating surely let's go back to our culture because I believe that's why our ancestors kina shosh kina gooks ndio wana na heshima ya kamob na hizi ma sisi tumeanza kukua na ile lifestyle diseases lifestyle diseases it's as a result of basically ni eat na kula so the more you eat junk the more you eat all these chemicalized processed foods then my friend the mortality rate will continue going down and down and down and mm. that's why you find at a time ya covid why do you think there was was no one expect as africans mm -hmm. not sana but what kept us going <laughs> our nature of eating mm. as in we turn out to be more stronger than them because in their countries junk food or is it fast foods is more affordable than these healthy kinds of foods that we eat mm. like ugali mboga githeri mukimo and stuff but you find in their countries it's more expensive to even prepare it so i support this thing of truly culture is true if possible we can have an interculture types of food and let's borrow kama ni merum na kulanga imili na itangwa tente a certain form of mukimo then let's Someone from the coast will send money to Liberia or something. I borrow a leaf. And let's continue hmm. with no this healthy control. eating. <sighs> okay. <coughs> In conclusion, <laughs> we, uh, we we are saying I uh, okay, in swali ama ni acha nikuulize kama swali. So, are we saying that kukula healthy si mas that you ufikire hizo mado siwende healthy you? Uh, kuna stores zingine you only find in certain malls na bay yao unaitoka <laughs> unaingia unatoka unatoka yeah so it doesn't have to be like that si lazima ni import machungwa from sijui wapi ndo nisikie <laughs> iko na vitamins ona <laughs> wenyewe mm -hmm. <laughs> kwanza ma machungwa pua ni ile imetokosha acha tena hizi za, za agriculture hizi zimefanywa nini zinaitwa ha grafting ama sijui mm. nini hizo zime zimechanganywa sijui na manini nini zikadungwa tu chemical eh hapa na machungwa pua ni ile 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 ushago 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 unaelewa maembe pua ni si lazima uende kwa unajua most of supermarkets na hizi manini stores zuko ngatu zimestock hizo 
as in enda kwa soko hmm. enda kwa ndani. soko direct hmm. eh hey, unapata ile kitu nuna kama ile season ya maembe ile ya ukambani unaelewa hiyo season that, those are the maembes but si rahisi usipate kwa super hmm. eh hey. na tizo za super unajua zimekapo for how long hmm. because utapata like mostly when you use buy ni unywa wanalipa paki <laughs> mahali wow <laughs> like an ordinary Kwele. person si raisi upate anazibai mm. ji hata anataka zile za soko maybe hata kuna watoto wengi ama anataka zikule for long atenda zile zimekuwa kumi ama tano fifty mm. babu naelewa lakini za super utapata hata nene so mm. so una imagine your cost alafu na sai living standard venye imekuwa so high mm. eh, so the best thing enda tu kwa soko get those stuffs from the soko most of the stuffs from the soko zo kwa fresh mm-hmm. so so hizo stuffs za zimekwa kwa super and hizo ma food stores as kwangi fresh mm-hmm. juzi na kapo for so long mm-hmm. kenye na zikip fresh ni hizo ma freezer manini manini which is not even good mm-hmm. just ata kuku kitaka kubenda tu kwa mtu anauza kuku naelewa mm-hmm. then you tafuta to a good kenyeji so is easy, easy broilers na masuju nini nini eh akutafutie mm. kuna mtu tu anakuona anaona tu wife material yeye <laughs> tu anaongea when the soko ukenye mm. <laughs> you are speaking someone's love language i'm sure <laughs> ati uko single tunakupata happy for media we you are welcome gentlemen tunakupata happy for media mm. all platforms mm-hmm. mm, lidio lodge cheza ka wewe na ati wewe usicheze kama wewe ona wewe na kumuza wi 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 all right naomba kuniwasome tu tu vitu tu tu wa mwisho we i'm seeing we run out of time i don't understand i'm a, do this as i'm opening the page remember that right for facebook y254 channel on twitter y254 underscore channel on the gram hashtag is wcw or wine money to conclude here what do you think in conclusion what do you want to tell the people um in conclusion i'd like to say that Eating healthy is all about your camera's over here. Mm. In conclusion, I could say that eating healthy is all about getting to know where and how these foods have come across. And let's go back to the local farmer. Let's go back to our cultures and let's put a stop to all these issues of trying to be digging deeper into your pocket so that you can say that you're living the life living the life is eating healthy and it's not a bad thing to eat healthy and just living the natural means let's go organic organic is the way to go and you'll never go wrong mas não orgânico nem pensa tu e quando é orgânico não me into é tudo já só conhece a o se estou que na minha gina let me just read the last couple of comments Caroline já that says a se se colar uma pumpkins ata coende a gente Charlie Fay that says bees easy no Dixon Kidinji says yeah he anaza kula anything hiyo venye be described ndio siezi rudia but amesema anaza kula ni anita nita says kuku kondo na mbuzi is kendrox kimone chura manze kelvin mwiruri says nderema kwet kwet nyama mm Pitney Sparks matumbo hata na dawa siwezi man juu sasa hii hata matapiko na kula uchumi bye bwana <laughs> wacha tumalize hapo this conversation has been regulated by sensitivity to culture so if there's a culture that you have that forbids you to eat certain things ni sawa hata dini if you have allergies or medical conditions pia if depends on your ability so sis give but mongelea foods maybe you like or we are talking about things that you don't like okay we have tried our best to accommodate everyone now See, thank you for being with us Nani. We have come to an end of why in the morning is about that time. Like in Makwambe usi zimeti. Acha tu why in the morning I wait for for Iran to complete complete because we have amazing content all day long. At white five on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter, white five four underscore channel on the gram. We need to vow. Thank you for allowing me in your homes. Now you have a fantastic day, okay? Bye. Wave any bye. Bye. bye.